everyday apps are increasing exponentially on the Play Store as well as App Store. You always search for an app that fits your requirement and you install. But there are millions of apps and it's hard to find the app that you want. So hey guys, my name is Kashif and today I will show you how you can find best apps for yourself with the help of App Match. Before I get started, hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to get notified for all my future videos. So now let's get started. Before I get into how App Match exactly works, maybe I should talk about how you can get it first. Most app stores don't really support app discovery services so this is not really a traditional app that you can just go and download in order to access app match. All I had to do use my smartphone and use the internet browser to navigate to appmatch.com. Once I had reached the page, I completed a very simple sign up process in order to create an account with the service. As soon as you have finished those two very simple steps, you can begin to actually use app match. Right away, you will be able to answer questions which when answered honestly with the point you in the direction of some pretty cool applications. The whole experience is definitely indeed too user friendly. To take the user friendliness even further, many aspects of app match allow you customization. If you don't want to be recommended games, then you can adjust that setting for yourself. Similarly, if you would rather see only paid apps or only free apps, you can tell app match that and they will adjust their recommendation accordingly. Using app match also doesn't ever really feel like a chore. Although some of the questions are written in a more mature way, there are some pretty irrelevant ones too. Looking through the app myself, I found myself laughing out loud at some of the questions and answer choices that were posted. You can tell that a lot of love has gone into app match and there's also surprising amount of questions available. Since this service is just in beta, I didn't expect for there to be quite so much content. Although you are restricted to answer just 50 questions a day, I never feel like I was that restrained by that limit. The app that app match recommends are generally pretty cool too. There were a couple of instances where I was recommended application that I already heard of. However, for the most part, App Match exposed me to apps that I probably never would have learned the existence of otherwise. App Match is meticulously reviewed to ensure that it meets App Match's high standard. This means that using App Match really feels like a premium experience even though the user is not giving actually paying a dime. So is app match worth it? Time is in many ways worth more than money. So is a service like app match actually worth your time? In my opinion, app match is a really cool service that is perfect for someone who is looking for a smartphone app but who doesn't really like the idea of finding those apps entirely on their own. It's incredibly polished. Especially considering that it's still in development, I found myself actually enjoying answering questions and looking over app recommendation when I was done. I feel like a less entertaining service like this could become something of a chore. I never felt bored with it and I was actually kind of excited to complete my next 50 questions the following day. I don't know how long it would take the novelty to wear off but I really like this service. If it seems like something that you would use then I highly recommend it. So guys that's wraps up for this video. Hit like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and I will catch you in the next one.